Uh, hello, my name is Lucy Kovalova. I am CEO of GUN Academy, its global e-learning project. I have an experience of few e-learning project organizations, and the uh, one I'm working on is uh, more inspired uh, by area people who participate. Uh, the aim of this project is to connect any person from around the globe to any educational institution, any trainer or mentor uh, from any country, so any person could get any knowledge needed. Uh, this is our aim, and we are working straight for this. The subject for today for the conference, uh, learning through your workplace, uh, I will try to focus on the um, needs of person to uh, manage things once you have a work, once you have a, a responsibility, family, friends, but you still have something to do more, uh, you want to achieve uh, something more, uh, maybe have some another work and get additional knowledge to do this. Uh, so we will go through this subject in a short structure. We will consider the aims, the theory, methodology, the practice, and we'll summarize what can you do with modern technologies once you need some additional knowledge to achieve your aims. A modern world provides us with a number of opportunities. Technologies nowadays uh, allow us to participate uh, on a number of activities. Uh, these activities could vary from the needs, from the goals, from your desires, uh, and so on. Uh, but how to manage all of these activities and combine all in one your work, your goals, uh, life, family, friends, and how to plan your next step uh, to stir up if you are completely stuck on your duty tasks. The responsibilities is what we still have to complete, uh, but steps forward are also we are willing to make. So the aims we will consider it could be your personal goals, company's goals, plans, where are you working now, and combination of these things if you are lucky so to have the combination to have some cross paths on these two uh, types of goals in your life. Uh, anyway, to move forward, to make a step, tear up, uh, the first thing to do is to define the aims you are following. Uh, the vision of your future doesn't matter if it's a picture of your constant work on what you have, uh, maintain what you've already achieved, or it's a way of changes you are willing to make to achieve your new heads. To define aims, people mostly start from the dreams and other days. And that's the reason for this. Self-realization is the process that starts from both needs and desires of every concrete person. As the needs every person realizes every day, because it's just what you have to do. And another way, desires, for most people, it's second point to work on after needs and responsibilities. Uh, once you have responsibilities, it mostly means you have a work to care all subjects financially, and sometimes it's difficult to look forward once you are overloaded with current subjects. What is important to realize, it's always a place, it's always time and possibilities to do this. It's always time, place, and circumstances to move forward. Do not wait for the correct moment to do something. It is a moment to do or to start it right now. Next point, do not expect you will achieve what you want right now. The first step is always the first step. It will be the second step, the third one, and next one, and so on. As you are at your constant work, the ways of development are crossed between company's needs and your personal. These two directions may differ one from each other. There is a beginning of some difficulties, but this also depends on where are you now. If the job you have contained at least a part of what you need, what you want to do in life, it's much easier. If the process of work-related development and your self-development does not cross anyway, this is not necessarily will be a problem. 
It often happens when your self-development activities are keeping you motivated for best work performance as well. Uh, the combination. The way to combine all you have and to plan steps of improvements are more convenient when your current circumstances and activities at least partially cover the dream and aim you are following. Or at least it's forwarded to the direction of the dream, the desire. Uh, let's here go back to what we mean by needs, desires, responsibilities, aims. Uh, the needs, uh, it's what you have to do, the desires, what you want to do, and how to correlate all of this. Uh, you need to have a strong plan and follow it correctly. Today, it's much easier to combine everything you need in one, to manage your life straight way. Technologies we can use provide us much more for our efficiency than we can imagine even before. The only thing is to start use what will help us, remove everything what we do not need to know and now to make and to know actually now because once you are going through uh, any additional books which are not related to the subject, you are aiming to get knowledge on and this subject is not covering your aim, is not guiding you to your aim, uh, so this is not exactly what you need to do now. So you need to remove everything you don't need now and make an effort to grow efficiently. Combining all in one work responsibilities, family and development study in general needs only, only one thing. It's correct time management and correct plan of what you are going to change or to achieve. And now we will go to the theory, and we will consider a few things, the readiness, motivation, plan, schedule, start, control, results, and benefits. Uh, we will start from readiness. Uh, once you decide to achieve something new, to get new direction, for example, for your career, um, new hobby, new life um, aim in general, few things combined in one. So for a start, you need to be 100% confident that you are going to change to achieve the plan things. The moment to be ready is exactly now. So just take a piece of paper and start planning. Know what you want, so write it down. And even if you don't know what you want, think on it, write possible things, write crazy things, so this way you are starting your planning. Do not stuck on these steps, it's only a beginning. It's first step you just need to do. Uh, next thing we will talk in short is motivation. Motivation for the processes you are managing for yourself is a little bit harder than for usual things you have to do. But your confidence on step one and staff one is 100% confident that you are going to change or to achieve the plan thing. And this confidence, it's your readiness to start, to start right now, this moment. There are some hints to keep yourself motivated. Uh, point one, celebrations. Once you made some step on the plan you are following, um, just be prepared to celebrate. Just little good evening with friends, some uh, wine, some walk, uh, other things, maybe holidays somewhere in Europe or something else. Just buy a chocolate for yourself, that will be great. Point two, hint two. Uh, support. You may need a friend to support you. So go look around and find someone to support you. Point three and hint three. Don't be close. Share with your friends and family the plan of changes and improvements you have. Let them help you. A lot of people around are ready to help you, so be open, share your ideas, even uh, you think they are really, really crazy, just share and see what happens. Point four and hint four, plan your time carefully and use your time wisely. 
Uh, next, we will talk about plan and schedule. Uh, and it's always better to work on an example, and we have one. Uh, uh, our example, a library worker has a desire to work in a business with sales. He has a family, says his financial responsibilities are strong, no savings are enough to support family if he leaves his job this particular moment. He is 25 years old and has a degree on informational science from local university. On what we have, what we heard, we can conclude for changes he will need to keep a job he has. Uh, he will need to keep it because he has his financial responsibility, family. Uh, so he will need to maintain all tasks for current responsibilities. But still, the aim is sales-related position in some company. We will not define right now what is the company size will be. What can we do? First of all, the list of skills and the aims. The aim number one is defined sales position. And let's focus on it because it's correlate with our subject. Skills needed to be written. And from what we have, we need to make a plan of what we need. Every person on every position already has a number of skills, communication, uh, some technologies, some computer-related skills, uh, languages, and other, and a lot of differences could be written down on a piece of paper. And another size, we need to write down uh, the skills list for the sales position, which this person, on our example, is uh, willing to achieve and willing to take, in short, um, as soon as possible, as it's always happened. Uh, so we need to write down the skills. And from this, we will prepare the plan. Additional skills needed could be defined from the job sites. For example, you will find the position and define what our HR managers are looking for the person of such position, even a low level, to apply for. So the list what to achieve we will define from the list of needed skills. We will write down what we need to achieve, which knowledge, which skills, maybe some language, maybe something additional on computer, or and so on, differences could uh, appear on this list. Second side of situation, it's uh, more likely than courses uh, and trainings or additional education, mostly should be confirmed with some paper. As the way of reading books, uh, just reading some articles through internet is not always enough to take, to get something new, to achieve something more. Uh, from this class clause, it's followed that depending on the aims on the list of skills needed to be achieved, we will need to find out the way of additional knowledge, skills, results delivery. And this way will also depend on the current person's responsibilities. Self-learning is good and convenient considering circumstances we have in our example, but it's not always enough, uh, especially if the aim we have is changes on career, on field, and so on. So this particular case we are considering, uh, let's talk about the possibilities. First of all, of course, it's classical education, but the question of time will almost make it impossible, except we will find a needed program online which still provides a diploma paper, and time needed for online learning is uh, mostly, uh, if we are talking about some classical university course uh, which um, delivered online, uh, so this study will take you a minimum to 20 hours per week, and it's quite uh, a lot of time, especially when uh, you need to maintain your current responsibilities also. Uh, and another thing, it will take you a few years to complete this program, uh, it's, uh, if we are not considered a study break. This is related to university programs delivered online. And another way, 
courses, online educational programs. Um, they have a list duration, which could take you a few months, and you will get the knowledge you need. And also, the, a lot of programs uh, who deliver to you a paper certificate that you um, learn on this course, that you know these things, and you're qualified enough to start work on this field. Uh, the modern reality is uh, flexible to such steps. So today and 2014, we have a wide range of opportunities to get new knowledge, to application skills uh, and knowledge, and based on results, move forward even without classical education. Here we have to know that it's much better to have diploma paper, to have your paper at your background, because once you have one uh, paper, you will get some additional courses, program, trainings, uh, take it together, so you will be almost, uh, can be almost sure that you can apply to a lower level or even um, absolutely new field for you, you didn't work before. At the case we are considering now, we will write a plan for additional education online-based trainings, live trainings, and so on. This way, we have a flexibility with time, length of plan realization. Uh, it's quite uh, more convenient, and other current responsibilities as tasks could be managed accordingly also. Uh, the plan could be written as, um, for example, point one, find out a current program, the length, for example, two weeks. Point two, find trainers, check feedbacks on trainings, and prepare plans for attendance for six months. Uh, and you, you will need to write down deadlines for each point. And for this point, we will not, for example, deadline is uh, in three weeks. Point three, for the program, you choose check the application procedure and apply. Point four, start attendance on the trainings you choose, conferences, clubs, meetings, and so on. Point five, find a friend for support or even better, the specialist on the field whom you will contact for friendly talk, for advice. Point six, time management. It's uh, almost most important thing will be in your plan. Write down all activities you are going to do day by day for two weeks, and this step will help you to reorganize your time management in order to have additional loadings with study. So then two weeks, reconsider your time frame, rearrange your time, you will be ready to start to study. Moreover, if needed, you can take some training on time management to assist you. Uh, it's also possible to change points one to three with specialized services by the company that are experienced on this. It will take an additional amount of money, but also you can uh, find free services or pay for over it. Uh, it's not so important. It's important to make every step with a fine. It will save you time. And you will be guided by the specialist what to do next, choose from the study options presented, and be advised on the additional short trainings you may need to help. Uh, for example, as we mentioned, time management training, it could help a lot to you. Now take the plan you've prepared and read it. Make sure the steps are consequent. Time frame is reasonable, not too short and not too long, and be sure for each step you have a deadline. This will help you a lot also. And now we are going to start and to control. Starting now, check the point one of the plan with our example, and start this evening, uh, or even now, depending on where are you. Maybe you have a break for lunch on your job, so you can start this task, this task now. And the point one we noted was uh, find a coding program, the length, for example, two, three weeks, five weeks, it depends of what you will find. Also, please do not forget to make notes on your time frame to rearrange your time management till the moment you will need to start your study. 
how to control better, first of all, do not be scared. And secondly, do not blame yourself if something goes wrong. Uh, that's not the way you've planned it to go. For example, you've planned uh, the point one of your plan, find the program you need uh, to learn the course, online course. You plan to find it in two days and uh, reasonable that uh, it could take a little bit more time to find a coding program. Uh, so you just do not need to blame yourself. And it will be. Sorry, I have a question on chat. I will just go. I have a very short presentation, which is only notes uh, the strict subjects, what are we considering. Uh, so maybe it's not so useful as was expected, but uh, it will give us the short, short picture of what we need to do. Now we are going to the next point, is results and benefits. Once you will have results of steps, not all done, to make your achievements written down to you. And another thing you need with straight request, check the plan. Check deadlines. If needed, change something, add or remove some point, fix deadline. But be careful, do not allow this step to cover your laziness. This is also very important thing. You can fix the deadline for some point. You can fix uh, an additional point to the plan you've prepared already. Uh, but uh, just be sure you are doing the right things. The benefits, uh, do not expect, do next, uh, expect them so far, because uh, you will need to take some time to find the program, to apply, uh, to choose trainings. Uh, you need to work and remember that work hard and results should come later. Now we are going to discuss methodology, what you can use once you have a plan to achieve your new heights, to have something new, to achieve uh, your dream possibly, to change your career in another direction. And we will consider the ways how to get the knowledge needed to these changes. Let's go briefly on the study methods could be combined on the plan you've prepared. It could be classical study, as I mentioned before. Uh, classical study lengths are longer than other programs. So the combination of online course for three weeks and five trainings from different mentors, from different trainers worldwide, uh, for example, two hours per training, could give you information not less, but will take less time to cope on it. So you, you just need to think and to choose if it could be classical study or online learning or just trainings and books. It depends on what are you willing to achieve. Uh, next point is live trainings, conferences. With modern technologies we have now, we can attend absolutely any training, not even live in your workplace. You can consider this planning uh, your study. Live meetings at controversy could give you more inspiration on the subject, live contact and conversation with other people. Uh, the weak side of live meetings is mostly higher price for live training and additional time needed to reach a place. Uh, moreover, if training is not in your city or even country, it could be a problem to attend to this meeting. The conferences, depending on the level of organization, could give you a lot of information. A lot of new contacts, new ideas, uh, just make sure you choose the correct one. You will for sure have a few not the best appearances before you will define how to choose your live conference uh, to attend. And today, as uh, we have exactly now, a uh, live conference online uh, which connects uh, people from any country to connect together to discuss topics interesting for specialists of the field. This is very useful and uh, could be even more convenient for every participant. Next point we are going to is 
coaching or mentoring effective, but it also depends on you. Not every person is ready to learn from another one person and be guided effectively. All of us need all mistakes to go through. So you will go through your mistakes, you will learn on them, and you will get your results later. Another thing you can use, uh, very popular now and popularity growing the uh, past three years for sure and will grow for next three years, I'm sure about it, it's online learning. It's real learning revolution and it's what we are using already wide and it will cover more and more aspects of education in coming years. Online learning gives you a flexibility and mostly economy, if not of time, but money, for sure. Uh, moreover, the programs we have connecting trainings, courses, mentors from different corners of the globe, this gives you also uh, such a great thing as communication, global communication with students from other countries, uh, with other experiences, uh, you have possibilities to share and to be shared with experience of other specialists and on the field and people who are learning to achieve new heights on this field. It's worth a lot and even quite more than you can spend for classical education. And other things which becoming popular is mobile learning, is uh, development of online learning, it's another grade of online learning, could be said. Uh, even more flexibility for every person around the world. Thus, preparing the plan, you can cover part of it with mobile learning to increase the effectiveness. And of course, it's useful to combine study, to combine the ways how you will get your knowledge, to combine educational methods. And the best effectiveness could be achieved combining live training, attendance, online and mobile learning, and even old with paper book before to fall asleep. So just prepare the plan, take needed materials, attend, apply, and you will go on the plan of changes. Complex training and development plan. This point is uh, about you will get the help of specialists to prepare this plan for you. And once again, it's useful to order specialist devices preparing your study and development plan. You will have what you need, devices prepared and scheduled for you, and moreover, such resources have uh, connections with different trainers, mentors, and uh, much more information you can search on in one or two evenings about the online learning programs, about the classical education possibilities and trainings, mentors um, from around the world. So you can attend today uh, the training on sales from the mentor from Portugal and tomorrow uh, time management training from the mentor from France and um, a few days later, you will attend uh, educational online program on sales from USA teachers. This is only the one short example how it could be managed. Uh, the practice, the results, applications, trials, success, failures, you will have some results on every point, so write it down. You will need to apply every short piece of knowledge you will get on your study. Just do not be afraid to do this. Just do this, make your own mistakes and learn on them. You will have your trials, you will have your success moments and you will have your failure moments. Just go on, move on your plan. On the way of changes, self-development study, every person definitely meets the challenges, fails and success moments. Uh, the desperation should not make us move back, not even for an inch. Uh, and to make this effort to follow changes today, we have more and more possibilities every day. So keep yourself motivated, use hints uh, we mentioned before, have a friend to talk, have a specialist and friend to talk, family, uh, your team members, uh, your co-workers, 
uh, a lot of things you can use to keep yourself motivated. Use celebration, uh, but do not forget to write down everything you already did and everything you are planning to do. To overcome all of this, the planning and control are very important. Following the subject we made to discuss, consider a very simple example, it was shown that with any circumstances today, modern technologies we are using every day allow us to make steps to other grounds. Working and living, every person still have a possibility to plan precisely and follow the plan of new achievements, take new hates. What one needs, a laptop, smartphone, tap computer, uh, but the most important today is the desire, is the desire to start your way to changes. Uh, this is my brief uh, presentation about how to, using modern technologies, any person could start your own way of changes, plan it correctly and follow the plan using modern technologies to achieve new knowledge and to learn new things. Uh, thank you very much. If uh, we have some questions, just let me know. My contact details are on the on this page, so you can contact me anytime. Uh, I do believe every presentation should take uh, not more than 20 minutes. I took 30, so uh, hope it wasn't boring. If you have some questions, you can send me uh, on email to my email or call me. We will discuss such things. Uh, so, my wish to every person listening this presentation is just move forward and achieve what you want in life. Thank you very much.